you know, sometimes teams do hold on to their head coaches a little too long for things to turn around, but it's not common for an NFL coach to be fired after their first year. You mentioned Dan Campbell. He hasn't won a single game yet. And you also mentioned Urban Meyer managed two in Jacksonville. Also, Arthur Smith has a shot to get to 500 in Thursday night football tonight against the Patriots. But is there a chance that a first year head coach will be a one and done after this season? So, so Dan Campbell could be that guy. For me, Arthur Smith, I mean, the difference between five and five and four and six is pretty big. So this week's game against the Patriots is really important. Since 1990, 30% of teams that started five and five made the playoffs. Who started four and six. So that's kind of massive. Uh, Kyle Pitts has lived up to the hype. A.J. Terrell doesn't get enough hype. And Matt Ryan, to me, is still clutch. Three fourth quarter comebacks this year has the highest grade from pro football focus since week four. Uh, last week's loss to Dallas was rough, but Smith took the blame. It was just one game. I think Arthur Smith is fine. Um, Nick Sirianni, another guy for the Eagles. The Eagles right now four and six, currently one game behind the five and five Panthers for that seventh and final playoff spot in the NFC. So still in the playoff hunt. I think he's doing all right. Uh, they actually beat the Panthers in week five. And get this, they have the third easiest remaining strength of schedule based on combined win percentage of remaining opponents. So if it happens, Nick Sirianni can become the third coach in Eagles history to make the playoffs in his very first season. That's still a, a big possibility there. They do need to find a way to win at home. They're 0-4 at home. Eagles fans are not going to like that. I lived in Philly for three and a half years. They love their Eagles. They're 0-4 this year. Four more games in Philly of their last seven. But since week eight, the Eagles actually lead the NFL 208.7 rushing yards per game. They're nearly 33 points per game since week eight, ranked second in the NFL. And Jalen Hurts, I like what he's doing out there. First quarterback since at least 1950 with 3,000 or more passing yards and 800 or more rushing yards in his first 14 career starts. So I think uh, Sirianni's doing all right in Philly.